Thank you. So we are here with Robin Raskin, and she is a blogger and a sponsor and so much more. Robin, tell our viewers a little bit about what you're up to. So we have a company called Living in Digital Times, and really it answers the question, what does it mean to be living in a digital world? And we have parts of the company called Baby Tech, we have Beauty Tech, we have Kids at Play, Moms, Seniors, Digital Health, Sports and Fitness, and today we're here showing the wearable life. So we have products, a beautiful bracelet that will tell you if you've been in the sun too long and send you a notification, a concussion helmet for football and hockey players you wear under your helmet and it tells you if you've been hit, the coach can take you out of the game, save your life. We have a little baby monitor that you put in a onesie and it will give you all your baby's vital signs so you can sleep easily. We have something called Bed It, which monitors your sleep and tells you how much REM sleep, how much, how are you breathing at night. And so all of these things that we say make the quantified life and tell you information you need to have a healthier, better lifestyle. Wow, that is fantastic. I know I'm an auntie and I have we have another one on the way in a couple of weeks. And so I saw that monitor and I thought that is absolutely fascinating. I had no idea anything like that existed. Amazing. We're also showing things you can make on a 3D printer like high heeled shoes. You design them at home, you send them to a company like Shapeways, you get a box of shoes the next day that you design just for you. So what's happening in technology is for the first time really, it's female friendly, it's designed with um, fashion and luxury and statement and style in mind so we're kind of psyched that we're doing this thing at the right time in the right place and people's jaws are just dropping when they stop by the booth. That is fantastic. So how can our viewers find out more about you? If they're interested in your products or connecting with you, what's the best way? So start out at livingindigitaltimes.com. That's our parent company, and you can see what I've been writing. I write for Huffington Post, I write for Chip Chick, I write for Everyday Health, but a lot about the quantified self, about parenting, about the need to, as parents, be mindful of your own tech. I call it parents behaving badly. You know, when your kids are going, Mom, pay attention to me, get your nose out of the phone. So we take a lot of those issues and try and come up with common sense way to deal with life that's changing so fast. I mean, we're talking driverless cars soon, you know, we're drones delivering things, we're, we're there, sci-fi. <laughs> <laughs> it's funny that you say that. I was thinking the other day when you used to watch the Jetsons. That was my generation. You know, as a kid, I was like, wow, we are kind of getting very close. We are so close. And the decisions, whether to have a designer baby, you know, that we have fertility things inside that track just when it's right to get pregnant. And you can decide what sex, you know. These things are all going to beg questions. Um, quality of life. We all know we can live longer because of technology. We know that you can track your kids, but do you want to track your kids every move? We know that you can track the older people in your life. Um, you can see, but you can be bionic. You can get hearing that makes you hear better, sight that makes you see better. So as we progress, we need reporters to be talking about the good and the bad and how to manage your media. Fantastic. Well, tell us again how people can find you www.livingindigitaltimes.com and I hope we see you there. Thank you so much.